a holdup in a multi-billion dollar deal that could shake up how we all watch television. AT&T's pending acquisition of Time Warner is being held up by the government. ABC's Karen Katursky reports on what could be complicating the major deal. AT&T Chief Randall Stevenson said today the Justice Department did not demand CNN be sold to complete a merger with Time Warner. I have never been told that the price of getting the deal done was selling CNN, period. And likewise, I have never offered to sell CNN. And I'll repeat what I said yesterday, there is absolutely no intention that we would ever sell CNN. The Justice Department said the idea of selling off CNN began with AT&T, but Stevenson called that patently false. AT&T has been talking about buying Time Warner for more than a year. But this week, the deal raised questions of White House interference. President Trump has blasted CNN for its coverage of him and disparaged its reporters as fake news. I think what CNN did was uh, unfortunate for them. They have been fake news for a long time. Fake news. Fake, fake, fake news. As a candidate, Trump vowed to block the merger, saying it would give too much media control to one company. Brian Stelter from CNN. The, uh, <laughs> do you have any reason to believe that there's a Trump factor? I have no reason to believe that. Based on my conversation with the DOJ, I'm doubtful. So I have no reason to suspect that. Stevenson says AT&T will head to court if the deal doesn't go through. Since the day we announced this, we've been preparing to litigate this deal. Aaron Katursky, uh, ABC News, New York.